Things have become increasingly distant between Sheila Sheik and her job dodging dope on a Robanto ever since the arrival on these shores of fantastic soccer stallion Ronaldo. Even as she sleeps peacefully, <laughs> Sheila is formulating her next plan of attack. Excuse me, sir. Do you know where Ronaldo is? Do you know where he's coming out? The following day, I went back to Carton House where Ronaldo was making an appearance for the Spanish media. Do you know where Ronaldo is? Do you? I don't. Oh, sorry. Oh, sorry. Oh, sorry. Oh, sorry. Oh, sorry. Will you? I'm going into Ronaldo. I know Ronaldo very well. He poked me on Facebook this morning, he did. See, Ronaldo was on a foreign exchange with me years ago, he was. And uh, he used to come to my road to learn English. And we thought he was great. He was a lovely Portuguese fella. But when he saw the Talagese, he didn't want to go home. He stayed an extra one to one. I was Ronaldo's first love. Are you going to put that on the Spanish television? I'm going to have to leave the premises. Look at you, to hack you. That's a decoy for Ronaldo. Is. Look him. I'd lash you out of it as well. I would. Give him half a chance. I'm going to go into Ronaldo if it's the last thing I believe in, dear. Yeah. I want Ronaldo! You love me! I have a child! I am Ronaldo's child! I'm going to call him Ronald! Because that's English for Ronaldo! No, Ronaldo needs me! He needs to have a lash on me! Oh, no, 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 no. was gonna stop me. I went through them ditches faster than a cattle getting burnt out of a hedge school. If I can break out into joy, I can break into Curtain House. There was only one thing left between me and Ronaldo, and that was me poxy knickers.